everyone and welcome to my video and today I thought I would um, show you guys a little small craft project that I've been working on and so I know Easter is coming up and so I've been contemplating back and forth um, what I'm going to do as far as an Easter soap so I don't know if my Easter soap will be ready on time but at least um, I'll have one on the website so the project that I decided I wanted to do is I found that I had um, well let me say this when I go to the store I always find some very good bargains on craft items and so today I was able to go to the store and I picked up these very pretty uh, rhinestones sequins and so usually I love to buy sequins and rhinestones um, not just for craft projects but for like when I go get my nails done I like to have sequins and stuff on my nails but as you can see in this video my nails are not done but either way um, this is something that I had in my craft arts and craft bag and I thought this would be a good time to put it to great use so I'm um, I can't remember what store I picked these up from but they're pink and they're very pretty so we're gonna use that um, also I went to the dollar store and found some decorative ribbon that was on sale So we're going to use um, that as part of my craft project and of course you need some scissors and the second thing was I found these very cute little stickers also um, in the, in the uh, dollar store around Easter time. Uh, since it's Easter I was able to pick these little stickers up and I thought they was like so adorable I would like to part of me says oh use the stickers like it is but because I'm feeling arts and crafty I wanted to do something so this is actually I'm gonna show you guys what I've been doing so the So the little ribbon that I picked up, I cut a piece of it and I placed it on top of the bunny ears. As you can see, um, these little sticker bunny ears is actually going to go in my Easter soap that I'm going to be making. So, but today the video is going to show you my little crafty idea. So I had a couple of these already made and we're going to take some of these sequins here and we're just going to probably place a few maybe as the they're very tiny. So, got some larger ones. <laughs> so, we're going to place these somewhere on the sticker and see what we come up with. <laughs> so, how about on the nose part? <laughs> Put some sequins there. I would have thought I would have used them for the eyes
Yes, I know this is tedious work, but it's fun. Now there may be other ways to do this, but again, this is just something that I had just lying around and I just feel like being crafty today. Now this, like I said, this would definitely work much better if the sequence was larger but I already have these and so I wasn't gonna I got some larger sequins somewhere just gonna go get them can't really see what oh this is door adorable Very, very adorable. Like the way it turned out. Can you guys see that? Isn't that adorable? So I thought that was really cute. So we're going to do the next one. And now that I'm actually looking at the little Easter bunnies, I don't know if I want to put the gold on the ears, um, the gold ribbon, because I think it would be better if I had like some gold glitter glue and so that would definitely look a whole lot better. If I had some gold glitter glue but I don't. So I think the next ones that I'm going to do won't have the gold ribbon on the bunny ears. But I like it, the sequins on the bunny nose. Maybe I can think of something else for the bunny ears. So we're gonna forgo the gold ribbon on the bunny ears because this type of ribbon, it stretches. As you can see, it has some elastic to it. And when I cut it, um, the ends are very ragged. And I don't like how the little rag, ragged look on it. But I still like the gold on the ears though. So we're gonna not do that. But we're going to continue on with the pink nose. <laughs> 